Okay. Is that a chicken? So this is a chicken uh, gyoza. It's good. I got the pork. Okay, yeah. Maybe we'll let you know which one's better. Yeah. yeah. Oh, this is my like true. second That's pork. That's true. Did you like the private shot chicken one or no? Mm -hmm. No. The chicken okay, one? the pork one's probably better. Than... You see, the chicken one is very, it's soft, like very soft, like it just kind of like very creamy, like creamy soft. Mm -hmm. It's good though. I definitely like it. Yeah, the thing I like about the pork one is that the pork one is like crunchy but then soft at the same time. So How? I feel like that adds a little bit of flavor to it, like the crunchiness. No, All she's right. right. The pork one has is more crunchy. Yeah. All right. Well, this is the pork one. Let me try. I like the chicken one better. Okay. Go with the chicken. Let me see. I already tried the pork twice. I'm gonna try the chicken. The chicken one has more flavor. It's more no, like take a whole like a whole bite as well. Really? <laughs> <laughs> it's good, huh? Okay, you wanna try the pork now? The low key tastes like the, the ones they have at Costco. The Wait, what? what was that? Oh, don't say that. No, what was I mean, that? No, I'm, I'm not saying they're bad, but I'm saying Costco has some good quality ones that you you put them on the microwave and it tastes really good. He doesn't go out. Okay, here, here goes the pork. <laughs> don't bite the chopstick. Which one do you like between the two? I actually think I like the pork one better. What? Yeah, what? You just don't like me, dog. Huh? Okay, Angie, what are you gonna try? Okay, so I got the jelly in a can. The jelly shot makes berry flavor. So, let's try it. The chicken one smacks, bro. Is it good? Okay, yes. Yeah. It's really good, and it has like a jello consistency, like little cups that you like open it and they're like flavored and they have like the little bits of fruits in them it kind of tastes like that yeah that mexican yeah. like candy the yeah i get you so if you see this in stores i Bye. highly recommend buying it mm. okay. all right try it <laughs> it's, really good though. it's good it's only called a sake jello shot is that good yeah, man. Oh, that's a good. wait did you oh, try mine oh. <laughs> that's good yeah it's good Ooh, okay, so that one was... Oh. No, yours? Oh, oh okay. I got the... Chuhi lemon. This is a Japanese white claw, and I got the lemon flavor. That's it? Okay, it's good. Swing it, girl! Yeah. Yeah. No, she, she chuck, chuck, it. chuck! Alright, we're good. We're as... We're as... It kind of tastes like... White claw, lemon... Lemonade. White lemonade. I'm not gonna even talk about this because everyone has tried this. There's some people out there that haven't tried it. Yeah, that's yeah, true. Just a dry beer. But lighter, Modelo. It's like a little, it's like its own taste, like right in the middle. Oh, okay, okay. It's a little bitter. So this is a Kirin Ichiban. It kind of reminds me of a mango cart, like from Golden Road. It's a nice little design. So let's see how it is. That's good. It tastes like a Ooh. light beer. So, this is a uh, sake, Nihon Sakari. It's basically, yeah, sake, it's unflavored. Um, it's in a cute little, it's in a cute little box. Let's see how it is. I'm drinking water. <laughs> it's good. Recommend. I highly how recommend. How much percent is it? Honestly, that's a good question. Let's see. Everything's in Japanese. What are you? I don't know. Oh, 13 percent alcohol. It's 13 percent. Girl. <laughs> okay, so this right here. Yes. This is amazing. Do you like I it? I taste water. <laughs> I taste the. Uh, I got. You taste. Water. Water. I'm sorry. You taste water. I taste water. I got it. Like you hear that? Taste water. That means she's already <laughs> drunk at that point. <laughs> that means you're drunk, girl. You taste water on that. That's, that's like. That's uh, that's like that's 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 cut the camera real quick. Hey,
What is this babe? Niku. A Niku rice? Some really good fried rice. How would you compare it to like regular chicken fried rice? It's good. It's got not nothing comparable. On. This is has way more flavor. It's like more. It's so good. It's. Wow. Yeah. What do you guys say? What flavors do you guys say? Let's see. Think. Tell me what you guys think. It's like warm and comforting, right? Like, and it's more moist than like regular fried rice. Like I just want to eat that on the couch watching Netflix. Exactly. It's very flavorful. Like a yes. lot, a lot of flavor. One, two, three. So we're here at Kaz Ramen, and I got the ka I got the Kazi with eggs, pork belly, and oh, like, I forgot what this is called. What was this called? Pork as well? Yeah. Well, this is a pork belly right here. And then this is the pork itself, and this is an egg, and I got spinach. And it's a really good combination. It's a good amount of spice flavor, and I really enjoy it. So I recommend it. You guys should really try it. The kazi is like dry noodle. Yeah, it's a dry noodle. So it's not like a, like pretty much like in a broth. It's just straight up dry. So I mean, some of you guys may not be into that, but I really enjoy it, and I, you guys should give it a shot. That looks pretty good. Yeah, it is. Um, vegan like vegan broth well not it's actually vegan broth it's like mushroom it's vegan broth because it's mushroom broth instead of like chicken or pork broth and then i got the yellow noodles i got spinach in it egg and the meat i got pork and then i also got corn in it and it's really good it's very flavorful miso broth with uh, yellow noodles uh, pork Egg, spinach, and then spicy level. I got spicy level. Uh, miso broth, honestly, really good. Like 10 out of 10 recommend it. Gives it like a lot of flavor, especially when you're eating it with the pork. And you could even see it has like the color, like the 10 out of 10 recommend. Wow. So I got the Niku ramen. I The spice level is spicy and it's just right. Like it's the right amount of spice, the perfect amount. Uh, for toppings, I got everything but egg and ginger. So that's like corn, spinach, tofu, pork, uh, mushrooms, and the noodles. A cool part, like a cool thing they do here is this are, these are actually spinach noodles. And I can't taste the difference between these and the regular noodles. I highly recommend. I can say I'm really enjoying this, um, this ramen. That means he's not enjoying it. Mm. Mm. Let's try chicken. Oh, and I also got eggs. She did it. I don't know why she did it. Let's try the eggs for this thing. I know. Why didn't you get that? I was surprised about that. I was Let's surprised. See. I was like, okay. So right here looks like a little baby chick was about to hatch, but it did it. Uh. <laughs> mm. I'm enjoying this. I'm digging this. I strongly recommend this place, cause. So after the club, when you just come here or what? Since oh, it's 24 right. hours. Yeah. So the beautiful thing about this, like my boy said, it's 24 hours. Um, you know, if you go club here or something, you want to come after, you know, sober up a little bit, stop by the Cavs. It's where is it in Riverside? Is it considered Riverside? It's like Grand Terrace. Grand Terrace. Um, stop by, check it out. Um, grab a bite, sober up, drive safe. They have beer too if you still want to drink. I would not recommend. <laughs> I'm over here saying sober up. Not recommended. I, I was gonna say not recommended, but you know, they got beer until two o'clock probably. But. And if you're not driving, yeah, grab a beer. Gordon, you guys can see how it looks. Aww, boys and cuties, like we're back. Okay. I wasn't even recording my bad. You are, you're gonna have to do it on a long day. You have to do it on a long day. Because either one, no one's recording you. I did it. Oh, you think 